Amelia Freer, I'm a nutritional therapist. I live and work in central London. I run a really busy private practice from my home and I see all sorts of different people for all sorts of reasons. I became a nutritional therapist because I didn't know anything about how to eat. In fact, I ate a complete junk food diet. I didn't really realise that food had any kind of impact on our health. And I was young, I was working in London, I was super busy. I was exhausted all of the time. I didn't have anywhere near the type of energy that a young 20-ish girl should have. And it was only when someone suggested to me that actually I might want to take a look at what I was eating. Once I took that little first step on the journey, I was quite appalled at how terribly I was eating. And uh, it was the start of a really, really big passion for me. I think skin is a really important reflection of our health and certainly I know that when I haven't been eating well or when I'm not feeling well, my skin is the first thing that shows it. And obviously I believe that we can really nourish our skin, most importantly from within. The most important things for skin health are hydration, fats and antioxidants. If someone's dehydrated then that's going to show very quickly in their skin. I can always spot when people are avoiding fats because their skin starts to go quite saggy. So we need to make sure that we're getting good quality fats into our diet. And obviously it's amazing if you can find skin products that have got those qualities in them too. It's really important that I'm taking care of myself in order to be present and look after my clients. I need to make sure that I'm really calm and energised. So I try to get early nights. When I wake up in the morning, I walk my dog, I have a good breakfast. I try to do some breathing before each client arrives just to make sure that I'm really focused and conscious for when they come in. And obviously at the end of a really busy day, it's really important that I get my downtime and try and get some chill out time before going to bed. My mother really taught me how to look after my skin and so from a very young age, I've always really, really taken care. So I will always cleanse, tone and moisturise twice a day. I'm very uh, a real perfectionist about using really good quality products. My skin has definitely started to change and it's definitely started to get drier so I really use a good quality oil and uh, once a week I'll use a brilliant mask to make sure that I'm just getting the ultimate glow factor. <laughs>